So I'll be in here, this one right here, the Instagram on this side. But when I bought it, I only bought one because I was like, I don't know if I'm gonna like this, like it this size or you know, something like that. So I was like, all right, I'm only buy one. And if I like it, I'm gonna buy the other one. So I liked it, bought the other one, and that <laughs> that boy never came. So I was like, bro, all right, whatever. So I saw a little Etsy thing. So I got the Instagram on this side. Um, I ain't gonna lie though, compared to the other one, this boy right here beefy. <laughs> That bit big, I ain't gonna lie to you. But uh, yeah, I was like, Instagram on one side, YouTube on the other side. So I just put that on there like two days ago. Hmm. I wanted to get a haircut, but uh, whatever, uh, it's all right. I just washed my hair, it's all right though. <clears throat> That'll do for right now, honestly, honestly, honestly. Look at that. Crazy, bro. God. Whatever. Show must go on. You know what I'm saying? Um. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Bro, I just got my car wash yesterday, bro. And I was driving on the highway just now, and it started raining. It didn't rain for that much. It didn't rain for that long, though. It didn't rain for that long. It was just like a little sprinkle, but still, like it always when you get your car washed, man. That's almost curse, man. Come on. If you watched the beginning of the old video, well, my previous video, uh, you see that I said I was going to the mall because I had just popped my uh, my rope chain or whatever. So you know, this is the new one. It's the same as this one. I didn't want to do two different ones, so I got the same one right here. Yeah. So, yeah, just wanted to get a little quick update on that. Yes, sir. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Scotty TJ, and I'm back here with another video. And as you can see from the title, we're talking about credit for young people. You know what I'm saying? I mean, if you... I'm not saying you're old, but if you're a little old, you know, you can, you know, this for you too, I guess, if you want to talk about it. Uh, but yeah, it's about like when you trying to purchase a car or anything, you know what I'm saying? Do you need credit? Is credit a factor? Stuff like that. The difference between financing with a dealership or financing with your bank or credit union, which one is best? Uh, okay, disclaimer, I'm just going to say this right now. Oh, this is my opinion. I ain't no guru, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I, I didn't go to school for this. This is all in my head, my opinion. So don't come in the comments going crazy, be like, oh, this and that, this and that. Uh, I went to college for this. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, cool. That's, <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's, hey, good for you. Thumbs up, buddy. Guess what? This is my video. <laughs> so I'm gonna talk about it how I wanna talk about it. Now I ain't saying I'm just pulling you know, crazy stuff out of the air, you know what I'm saying? But this is my opinion, this is what I think, and this is how it's gonna, you know, go for the video. So let me give a little backstory on my credit history, right? So let me see, I had credit for, I think, going on about two years now. So when I first got credit, right, I was in college, college Charleston, in uh, Charleston, South Carolina. Good little school, good little school. Anyways, uh, so I was in college. I had uh, applied for a loan or, you know, a school loan. And, you know, they have different options. You can defer it for, like, after you graduate or you can, you know, pay interest on it. So when you go to pay the loan, you only have to pay the loan, no interest. So I was like, okay, let me, let me do that. Not knowing that it would give me credit because I'm not knowing nothing about credit at this moment. Know what I'm saying so you know it was just like a hundred dollars a month you know what I'm saying so I was doing that next thing you know something popped up I don't know what it was I, something popped up but I had, I had the first time I checked my score it was like 630 I was like oh, I got credit okay so I started downloading credit apps you know what I'm saying and yeah so I started doing that right there so that's how I got credit um and my credit history 
to this day is still um, 100% payment uh, history, you know what I'm saying? So that means you didn't miss a payment or you know, you wasn't behind or anything like that. So yeah, you know, I'm pretty proud of that. You know, knock on wood, so you know, you never know. But uh, yeah, so I think that's when I first started and I was like 19 at the time when I first started getting credit. So, I mean, that, that's, that's, an, that's an okay age, that's an okay age. But uh, you can start getting credit, you know, when you're uh, a baby, you know what I'm saying? If, you, if your parents set you up right, you know what I'm saying? But we'll get into that in a minute. So, is uh, credit, you know, is that a biggie when you're buying a car? Me personally, at this age, I would say yes. Unless, you know, you just some rich man that's about to pay the whole thing cash from the dealership then they might not care about the credit. But if you plan on financing, then yeah, credit's gonna be a big factor, probably on your payments or whatever, you know what I'm saying? Cause uh, if, if your credit not that good, either they, might, either they might say no, or they might say, you need to put a big down payment on it, then your payments still be crazy through the roof, you know what I'm saying? But, bro, somebody, somebody count how many times I say you know what I'm saying through this video, cause I'm trying to stop, cause I was going crazy in the other video. Somebody count how many times I see, you know what I'm saying, through the video and uh, comment that, cause I'm, I'm trying to stop that. I'm trying to stop for real, for real. Credit is crazy though, the way, the way it works. Credit is crazy because you can make 10 payments on time. No, 12, you can make a whole year worth of payments on time. It might go up 10 points, 15, 20 points, if that, you know what I'm saying? You miss one, <sighs> hey, say, hey, you miss one, down. That been dropping for real, for real. I be like, God. Oh, I miss. I was, I was like a day late on one of my, one of my payments, one of those interest payments. I was like a day late, bro. That thing dropped like fifty points, man. I was almost in the five hundred. I was like, God, Lee. But the thing about that is, you, I paid, I paid one hundred percent for the next three months or something like that. And it went up further than uh, it went up higher than the where it was. So I was like, okay, boom, you know, it's not that bad. So when I bought my car, my credit score was at about a 730, 733, something like that. So it's okay, you know, not bad, not great. I think it was like 800, 850 now. So, but you know, me when I uh, financed my car, I did it through my local bank not the dealership I'm not saying the dealership is a bad choice but it wouldn't be my first choice personally so if you would ask me like where should i finance it i would say bank or credit union dealership last because they be trying to do all types of crazy things man so i would uh me personally i would do a credit union or you know local bank and anything like that but uh I mean, I've known people from the dealership that got, you know, good interest rates, stuff like that, but no, so, you know. But uh, yeah, so, you know, you always hear all these stories about how young people get cars and they have the interest rate through the roof, you know what I'm saying? Be like 10%, 15, 18, I'm not gonna lie. I thought I was just a joke until I actually met people. <laughs> I actually met people with those interest rates. I was like, and they tell me it was like I didn't know anything. You know, I'm going to buy a, I'm going to buy a car. I didn't really know anything about buying cars and you know interest rate and all this. And you know, dealership gonna take advantage of that. You know what I'm saying? They gonna they gonna get over it. So I mean, you know, if you're watching this video, you have questions about it, or you have questions, especially like questions about like uh, Mopar cars or like you know, Scat Pass, Hellcats, or you know, you can do Ford to anything. But if you really have mainly about Mopar, I, I, I really. I'm not gonna say I know a lot, but I, I know a good bit. So I know like the price, what the price should be and all this stuff. I mean, and you can use uh, Kelly Blue Book, you know what I'm saying? All stuff like that, so. Uh, but uh, yeah, you know, just hit me up if you have any questions about, you know, what uh, you think you should be paying for this car. Is this the right amount for this car this year? All that stuff like that, how much miles on it? So, you know, when I bought mine, 
I bought mine for like uh, I think about two or three thousand dollars under sticker, like final price. It was under sticker price, so it's okay, not great, but it was okay. Uh, yeah, so uh, I did that and I got fully approved for it. I have to put nothing down, so I didn't. I didn't put anything down, and uh, yeah, that's how I got this car right here. So I mean, but. I know I already hit on this in the uh, in one of my previous videos, but I'm gonna say it again. You know, do your research, man. You know what I'm saying? Do your research, or hit me up. You know what I'm saying? But do your research, man. I'm saying, do your research. I was researching these cars for like probably say a year plus, man. You know what I'm saying? A year and a half. So like, I know. You know what I'm saying? I knew what I was getting myself into. I, I had a rough estimate of my monthly payments, the insurance, if it had this much miles on it, how much it's going to be, if it's going to be this, how much it's going to be, all that. You know what I'm saying? And my rough estimates are in the ballpark of my prices now that I'm paying. So, you know, I was fully prepared. I already knew what I was, you know what I'm saying? And that's good. That, that goes for any car, not just, you know, muscle cars or, you know, stuff like that. It's any car you want to get. If, you know, if you want to... You know, you know, if you want to buy that car, you know, just yeah, research, man. Do your research. Don't, don't, don't go in there blind, man, for real, because dealerships take advantage of that. Don't go in there blind. But me personally, I say don't even own a dealership. I'm trying to finance through them. Look at that car. Contact your bank or credit union. I already have that money. So as soon as you go there, you be like, boom, I want this. I already got my money. Let's get it. Let's get that stuff right boom you got your car you don't have to go through all that other stuff man you know what i'm saying because me i know uh one time before when i was in the dealership and they uh they ran my credit and my credit karma and all that stuff just running all you see is emails coming through they saying uh increase 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 because what they do is they uh they run your credit you know what i'm saying they through all these uh lenders or whatever you know what i'm saying and see which one would uh you know accept you accept you essentially see which one that accept you essentially so they run it through all this and see if you you know you can get approved then they come back oh i got you approved 15 percent uh, no mm -mm. i'm not paying that money i'm not paying uh, what credit score would I think you should have before even, you know, walking into a dealership or even thinking about buying a car? I would say nothing lower than a 650, nothing lower than a 650 to 680 in that range. Really 680, but you know, 650 can, you know, you can, <laughs> you can wiggle up in there, you know, you know, how, you know what you're doing, you know what I'm saying? You can get up in there. But uh yeah, nothing lower than that. 650 is like bottom bottom, I would say, you know, for you to go in there and start even, you know, wasting on people's time. You know what I'm saying? Ah, I said it. I said it. I said it. Uh we can talk about interest rates for a little bit. No god So I mean obviously common sense, the lower the better, you know? So uh my the interest rate on my car right now is uh they like 4.04 i think which is not bad but it's not that great for me i wanted mine to be like uh i wanted mine to be like three or 2.9 you know what i'm saying i wanted to be like 3.5 or lower that's just me i just that's how i wanted mine but uh, so obviously, you know, the higher the interest rate, the more interest, you know, you're gonna pay on top of the car price. So, you know, lower interest rate, the better. So, you know, if they try to hit you with a high interest rate, you know, simply tell them no, you know what I'm saying? Just be like, no, I, I don't know. I don't wanna do that. And, you know, if you act like you're about to walk out, most time, what they're gonna do, they're gonna, you know, hold on, hold on, hold on, wait, 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 wait. 
let me let me talk to my manager let me see what we could do you know all this crazy stuff and if they say bye this is <laughs> and tell them bye be like no this is not what i'm doing i'm not i'm not doing it so you know just uh yeah don't don't you know don't be so hungry you know what i'm saying yeah i know i know you want the car but just hold out for a minute you know what i'm saying just just, just hold out you be all right you be all right now let's talk ways to get credit or get your credit up you know what i'm saying let's talk that let's talk that um so ways to get credit like i said earlier that's one way about the uh paying the interest on it or you know you can go to uh you know local furniture store or something you know buy a little chair or buy a little table or something make payments on the table you know what i'm saying something like that you know simple stuff just uh you know credit cards yeah um yeah the little entry level credit cards you know they have them uh you know little starters you can get one of those and uh your credit limit might be low but you know as you keep paying on it doing better you will get uh you will get most time they increase or you you know you can ask for an increase or you just get a whole nother credit card i think right now i have like probably six credit cards if that i think six yeah do i use all of them no the one i use most times my uh my mx my mx platinum i that's like the main one i use but you know uh you know keep that keep that credit usage real low now low credit usage is good you know what I mean? uh but yeah get a little credit card a little starter credit card you know don't go crazy on it you you might see like a two thousand dollar limit oh man i'm about to go go shopping mm -mm. Mm -mm. you know what i'm saying one of the biggest one of the biggest things i would say for people i wouldn't even say for people for me that i still forget sometimes it's so it's so easy to swipe it you know what i'm saying it's so easy to swipe it you know you swipe 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 you gotta pay that money back now <laughs> Hey, the, hey, them boy want their money back now. Hey, yeah, hey, you doing all that swiping? You swipe, swipe, swiping. You ain't think about, hey, hey, pay that money, boy. You, hey, you got, yeah, you got to pay that money back, man. That's all I'm saying. You got to pay that money back. And you know, sometimes I be forgetting, and you know, I be, I be like one hour open when I'm opening that app when I'm about to pay it, man. Oh my gosh, I be thinking like, oh, I know I ain't spend that much. He be like, it's probably like three hundred max yeah Ooh, hey <laughs> whatever whatever you think your uh your bill is go ahead and times about two i ain't gonna lie to you man i don't want to been there thinking about 200 800 i'm like what, what? and you go back <laughs> you scrolling through like did i ain't no way i spent all that money yeah you did you did you doing all that swiping man you know what i'm saying so don't just go out there and swipe 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 me personally i would say just uh when you start start on gas just pay a little gas you know what i'm saying we go to the gas station pay it with the credit card you know what i'm saying and then pay it back that's what i would do i'm not about to get deep into credits credit you know and credit cards and all that because i don't know you know what i'm saying i don't i'm not a like i like i said in the beginning of the video i ain't no credit guru so don't so don't 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 come over here thinking i'm about to lay out a full plan of what you need to do and all this stuff but yeah, you know, if you have any questions, you know, please hit me up. And uh, I got POVs coming up, man. You know what I'm saying? I said it. I just said it. Stupid. Anyway, I got uh, POVs coming up. Got more cosmetic stuff coming up. I have. Uh... Let me let me let me be quiet. Let me be quiet. Yeah. Just know I got some stuff coming up, though. You know, <sighs> bro. I'm trying to stop that jump hard man it's, it's hard but yeah i got got a lot of stuff coming up so yeah you know stay tuned you know please comment what you would like to see but yeah i got a lot of povs coming up man uh might do a few pulls on the uh little, little 40 rolls 60 rolls on the interstate i don't know you gotta see you gotta see Gotta see, bro.
<sighs> Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Share this with your friends. You know, if you have a friend that's uh, about to buy a car or thinking about it, you know, I'm, hey, I almost said it again. But hey, just send it to them, man. You know, share it out. Do all that, man. Let them know, man. And if you like this video, you want to see more, you want to see another video on some, something specific, just uh, comment it. And, you know, I'll gladly make it. You know what I'm saying? Even if I don't know anything about it, I would do the research to, you know, see, you know, what's what put it with the knowledge I already know and boom we got a little video just like this right now this video right here was like literally like off the head you know off off the top of my head I just thought about it I was like yeah this is I, I didn't write anything down I, I that's what I wanted to write something down but I didn't but yeah this video right here just 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 off the dome you know what I'm saying but uh yeah obviously I can't stop saying you know what I'm saying but whatever <laughs>